Hey, this is Paul Leo Jr. And in today's video, I just wanted to give you, give you a very simple solution on basically how to set either your um, your laptop uh, or PC or even your phone or tablet as a security camera. So uh, by using you know the uh, built-in webcam, a webcam that you have attached via a USB, or you can have it, you know, have your phone as the uh, security camera as well. So, for my little uh, project, I wanted to have I wanted to test something that was completely free that I could check in, uh, you know, where I'm at, you know live from you know wherever whenever i left so you know just to have you know just to test it out you know go in live have something that had motion detection and so forth and it's called it's actually called alfred security camera um and it is available for basically every platform imaginable so you know windows uh, Mac, iOS, Android, all that, and they can all be used. Um, you, you you can either use them as the viewer, or you can use them as the camera. So right now, so what I did was first you download the app. Okay. Now after that, uh, what I'm going to just show you right now is I'm going to you would just open up the app. Um, and what you do is you actually just make an account with your, um, you know, either with your Gmail account, uh, I think you can do it with your Facebook account, you could do it with a custom, you know, account, it doesn't really matter, so, and then, uh, what you, and then you can view, uh, the web you can view the webcam live from anywhere so right now i'm on my cell phone and this is a free version they do have a premium version but i can check in at any time now granted this is just a test so i'm in a different place right now hit live and so yeah it is dark right now but the one cool thing they have is kind of like a um, it's called low light, but it's kind of like night vision, so to speak. So you see, so it's low light automatic, and then that's like, you know, kind of, it's not that dark there, but that's just how the camera is viewing it at the moment. But if you want to get, obviously, you know, the whole uh, landscape of it, you would go to low light uh, if it were darker out. So you see the... Uh, the Alexa is spinning in the background there, and then they have these features where you can record, uh, you know, talk through this, talk through my phone, uh, <laughs> you know, through the laptop. So I could say something through, right, you know, if I hit talk and I talk and I uh, and it came out through the speakers on my laptop. Uh, I could even say, you know, <laughs> Alexa, do this, or whatever it was. So, you know, anything like that, which is pretty cool. So, the the free version is just, it's very, it's, the quality is basic. It's not HD, but it still does the job. And, you know, obviously, if I had more lights on, it would look, you know, a, a lot better than this. Um... But, you know, it is getting dark out right now. So I have my Alexa running. Um, I have this guy running. And then, I, you know, my whole separate security system running. But I wanted to test this out. So um, if you did want to actually, you know, see a live feed from your uh, mobile device uh, to your home. Or, or wherever, you know, you wanted it to put your laptop or put a phone so so basically when you open up the app all you're going to do is like i said just log in um you or create an account you know with a gmail or whatever doesn't matter after that <clears throat> now let's say you want to set it up 
as you know you want the laptop to uh, be your uh, you know your security camera quote unquote um, it will literally guide you step by step as soon as you start um, as soon as you open up this app it'll tell you to go to I think it's uh, like literally like Alfred dot computer like you just go to a web browser so you don't even have to install any uh, software on your you know on your computer or your laptop you just have to go on your um it has to be chrome firefox um or safari i believe you go into one of those uh web browsers you go to that um to that site and then it gives you this option where you can you just log in or you can actually pair it through just scanning the barcode so um, yeah, it's very simple. <laughs> Trust me, literally, uh, create an account, just follow, just go step by step with the instructions. And then you can set this up as whatever, you know, you can have, I can add another camera if I want and just log in somewhere else, you know, with a different, you know, say with a different computer or with a different, say I had a phone laying around, I could log in with that and make that a camera as well, you know, and <laughs> you could have them all over the place, you know, all over your house. So, but this was just a test with one. So, uh, this is the free, this is the free version. And for me that, you know, it's great because it does have, you know, motion detection. Um, and it will alert you with that. It'll with the free version, it'll only save your files for, um, I think like maybe a week tops and then it will get rid of them. You know, like, let's say if it, because it will record the motion detected for a certain amount of time. Now, you go to the premium, which I do not have. Um, so, uh, the premium is, what, $2.49 a month for a year. So, and, you know, here's all the things you can get. HD viewing, zooming, record longer videos. Um you know, have a motion detection schedule and keep new events for 14 days instead of, you know, just a week. So, um, you know, for me personally, you know, I think this, this one works well enough that, you know, personally, I wouldn't need something like that. If you felt like you needed to keep storage for two weeks and you really wanted some crazy, you know, you're not crazy, but you know, some really high def resolution, you know, then sure, go for it. But I like the fact that I can just view it and, you know, I can hear the sounds. I don't know if I have it built, if you can hear it, but, um, so I can switch the low light, have the low light automatic. That's probably the best one to put. So when it's lighter out, you know, obviously you can see a lot more. Um, but, so this is actually a good time for me to do it. I can mute it, not listen to it if I don't want to, you know, um, I have the option to even record while I'm in there. So uh, the only thing is that sometimes it does have, um, you know, it does have ads because it is free. But hey, man, if it lets you add a couple cameras and you can view it live, um, you know, anywhere you are, you know, as long as you have an internet connection, then, you know, I'm all for it. So five stars for this free uh, security system, you know, just using, you know, you can use an old phone, an old laptop. You could even have like your existing computer or laptop that you keep, keep on all the time and just open up your web browser and, um, you know, just go from there. That's it. So no software is required for the computer at all. You just need a web browser. That's it. So, uh, hopefully that was a simple enough explanation. <laughs> Literally the app will show you step by step how to do this, but this is the best software, uh, or be whatever you want to call it, application software service that I have found that allows you to, um, you know, create a free, uh, security camera with either your laptop, PC, tablet, or your phone and view them you know, with any, you can view with any of them or you can make any of them a camera. It's 
really awesome. So I could have this in two separate spots. So I could have this camera, let's say for home, another camera for work or whatever the case may be, whatever, different rooms and so forth. So, but all right, that's all I have. I really just wanted to show you a good old uh, Alfred camera. So, uh, as, so when you search it, look for Alfred security camera, I'll try to, I'll try to put some links in there. So thank you very much for watching, and that's all I have for today. All right, see you later.